this is marvelous. And now we have right look look in front of us we have a lot of uh, simply can be called toys yeah, yeah science uh, experiment toys science experiment toys uh, this is marvelous and we want to know more about it and this is actually the product that we have worked for and we work that for you so we prepare that for you we discuss about how to integrate Islam and the little scientists okay together so me uh, Saza Isfadia and also Miss Ho we present to you a certain work that we already done specially for you so let's take for example in little scientist program we do have a topic on light and shadow whereby children will build a polar bear puppet mm -hmm. and they can play with this we actually not only talk about light and shadow we also link with uh, conservation mm. uh, we talk about how to pre protect the environment yes. uh, we talk about global warming mm -hmm. so um, this is a very fun puppet that you can the children will, can play and after learning about that topic yeah a very simple but very special now the for the islamic values that we have discussed last time so this is about how to make them aware from the shadow they can detect the time for prayer, especially for Zohor and Asad. Wow, great! So let's move on to another topic where we we teach the children about mm -hmm. color mixing. This is a color mixing frame yeah. that we have created, and the children will do this by themselves. But up at the end of the the activity, they can actually mix these two colors up and get a new color. See, yellow and blue, I get mm -hmm. green. Yellow and red, I got orange. Orange, yeah, this is yeah. great. Uh -huh. So this is on a topic on color mixing. Mm -hmm. right. Me to me myself, must mesmerized by that. <laughs> it is so amazing. Yeah? So to teach the children uh, by knowing the color, they can uh, mixing of the color, they can uh, appreciate the color. So as a Muslim, of course, we can teach them that color brings a message and in islam so we even rely on the color of the sky okay, to detect like maghrib prayer and then subu prayer so this is how we uh, make full use of the color around them okay to know what color and also to determine the color oh this is daytime oh this is night time and this is subu time to differentiate between subu and duha to differentiate between maghrib and isha by color so mashallah exploring little scientists also help us to teach islam to our children okay so not only we explore about colors mm -hmm. we do do experiments in the lessons children will be doing experiments using thermometer to put into the water and measure the real thermometer mm -hmm. but at the end of the sessions they actually bring home a mini thermometer so um, I love this because when they bring home, mm -hmm. they are so excited. They want to test it in mommy's car, test it in their refrigerator. Yeah. <laughs> so um, we think this is a great kit for children to bring home. Mm, the Islamic value also from the temperature, we can let them imagine and help them even if we want to tell them about the story of hellfire, about the story of the torment yeah, in the graveyard. So normally, uh, whenever we talk about belief or iman, yeah, as a parent, I myself, I have a very hard, um, hard challenges, a hard time to explain to them about um, health fires. All right. So to explain to them, using temperature, we can tell them the highest temperature goes 100 degrees. So you can then multiply 100 degrees times 10 or times 7 to become 700 or 1000 degrees can you imagine mashallah this small little device can again help the children to understand uh, the hellfire uh, the punishment of Allah okay the need that we need to believe yeah in the hereafter so in this little scientist program children not only are able to do hands-on experiment science in their science lesson, they are also going to learn all the Islamic values that Ustaza and um, our team has put into it. And these children will benefit starting from a very young age. So please log on to our website www.littlescientist.com to know more about our program. Thank you.